So it's Felicity from Get Your Rock Out here with a couple of the guys from Candid and Equity. Uh, how are you doing today? We're good, right. thanks. You? Fantastic. Thank you. Yeah, I'm very good, thank you. It's a shame that the windows in the press area don't open. <laughs> <laughs> you know, kind of, kind of middle of summer, yeah. Um, but apart from that, all good. Um, we're here at SOS Festival 2013, and you guys have pretty much just come off stage. Um, so, how did the set go? Brilliant. Very well. Yeah, yeah. we're Fantastic. pleased with it. Yeah. Fantastic. And you guys have had a bit of a disaster this morning. Yes. Um, so, kind of tell us, tell us all about that. Yeah. Um, well, we got back in at 10 o'clock this morning. We were said to our swinger, "We're going to pick you up at 12 o'clock, ready to go." And we got a phone call off his brother saying he was in hospital with suspected pneumonia. <laughs> So we was like absolutely flapping. I was wondering if Paul was okay because we'd only spoke to his brother. We didn't know what state Paul was in. Um, so yeah, we was worried about this afternoon because we didn't want to let the guys down at SOS. Um, so the first thing we said was like, we'll do it without a singer. And then we thought, we'll just get one of our friends in. And then we rang Carlos, didn't we? And Carlos said, yeah, I know a few of the songs, so I'll just jump in for you. So it was a very last minute, very pushed. But yeah, we did it, so... Bit of a rehearsal in the van on the way up. Yeah. <laughs> it was all right. We got through it, didn't we? We got through it, yeah. Glamorous life of rock Get and roll, hey? Paul. <laughs> yeah, and so have you spoken to him now? No, we're yeah. just keeping up. He's on Facebook oh, posting, so we're keeping track. <laughs> Poor thing. So, oh, yeah, yeah, much, much love to him then. Yes, definitely. <laughs> so I'm guessing that you're going to be heading there to visit him after this. Yeah, that's yeah. exactly what we're doing. He is our leader, and he? He's our tr true frontman. So without him, we go down like a sack of spuds. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But yeah, I mean, so congratulations for pulling off a set like that. I mean, it's it's you know it's unbelievably difficult to do something at a couple of hours' notice. Yeah. So well done for them. Thank you. Did it so well. I hope it came across okay. Yeah. I'll we'll try and see some it videos later. Fantastic. And so it's it's great sound in here though as well and everything sounded huge it's done a brilliant job just want to say thank you to the guys for putting it on that's it they yeah. worked really hard a lot of them Mark's from brilliant. rock sector so yeah, they are an amazing amazing group of guys actually it's so it's organized fantastic. as well like realistic you know what i mean like change over times and just have plenty of time it's dead laid back and chilled out that's it yeah. that's what we like definitely um, I think the last time we spoke to you guys was at Blood St uh, SOS Festa last year, I think. Um, was it the was it, did we not interview you anyway? Did I'm pretty sure Heather interviewed you anyway because you were here. No. Um, oh, when was it then? Did you do uh, the academy? We did an academy show. Yeah, I'm sure you did us there. We did two that could have been. There, that so. could well have been it. Yeah. That could, <laughs> no, it was Heather that was doing it. I That's think. It, yeah. So, yeah, yeah. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. So the last time we spoke to you was at the academy. Yeah. Um, so give us a brief rundown of what you've been up to since then. Working. We're a very realistic band, unfortunately. <laughs> but it's, um, yeah, we work full time. All of us don't we? We're all busy, so. We've got um, our own rehearsal place now, um, oh, which my dad did for him. So me and Andy get a lot of time to get some new tracks down. Brilliant. We can rehearse. Um, we've got a merch store, um, <coughs> candidstore.com. Um, .co.uk, is it? No, dot .com. Is it dot .com? .com. And, yes, <laughs> I know. Candidiniquity.com, and that's got a load of different stuff on there our friends set up for us. Um, we had a banner done, which is something we've not done for five years. So <laughs> that was a big step on it. Yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, we're hoping to do some recording later this year. Um, yeah, and just play as many shows as possible. We've changed, kind of changed our style. We 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 write on six string guitar, and now we've changed to a seven string. So the new stuff it. is completely different from the old. Um, the old stuff's like very rocky. Um, it's heavy metal in it, but it's yeah, rocky. Yeah, yeah. It's bouncy. Whereas the new stuff's like really deep and dark and heavy. But yeah. it's yeah, it's it's a direction we want to go in. I think, isn't Definitely. it? So Ollie's enjoying it a lot more because we've improved as players as well. Technical side. I mean, well. Ollie's always like kick my ass with with playing. He's just such a good bass player. So now to like step it up a bit, he's you know really he's interested. challenging, which is good. Yeah, he gets cramped in his right him. hand, which is surprising. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. And so uh, the new stuff, have you written a lot of new stuff? Have you got a lot already? Yeah, five new tunes on the seven string, yeah, yeah. and a sixth one on the way. So. so hopefully we'll have a probably an eight-track album, really, by 
End of the year, I'd say, realistically. Yeah, end of the year, maybe early into next year, definitely. Yeah. 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 Anything since 2010? Yeah. So, because of, of work time. commitments and stuff, it's really hard work. It's horrible. It's impossible trying to make a career out of this and you know earn enough money to live as well. Enjoyment at the moment. Yeah. Into... So we've all got like we all, as I say, we all work full time. So finding time for this is like when we're hard. free, the others aren't free. Yeah. Paul's a long distance lorry driver, so he's Monday to Friday, no chance. Holly works in a pub, so weekends gone. Yeah. Very and we hard just to sat find around time. going. <laughs> and four o'clock Friday like that. Yeah. It's really exciting to hear about the new stuff. Um, no, I mean that's that's going to be going to be fantastic. Um, so the next kind of kind of six months or so, what else have you got planned? Obviously, you're going to be recording, I'm guessing. Yeah. Um, and what else is coming up? Um, we've got a gig on the the third of August at Satan's. Third of August, Satan's Hello. Yeah. Um, we're on second to last that day, and then we're on uh, the North Prevails show at the Witchwood in Ashton. That's the 18th. North Prevails is a, 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 a <coughs> two guys in a band called um, One Down, and they work at the Witchwood, and they're putting on a like an all day of it's the the the, 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 the style of bands that are playing it would the, it's very. They wouldn't be playing here, sort of thing. You know what I mean? It's that. Like, it's um, like metalcore, hardcore. Metalcore what, yeah. and hardcore bands, and um, I think Bring Me the Horizon and bands like that. And um, yeah, we're playing with some silence. Suicide Silence. Yeah. So we're playing with um, a band called Continents, Fed to the Ocean. Um, so yeah. hopefully. If so we've run about half six then. Yeah. And then we've got um, we're playing the Ruby Lounge in Manchester. We're doing oh, the Halloween night. night for Cage Asylum, with, um, the 26th of October. So there'll with, um, be pole dancers and everything. A Slipknot tribute. tribute yeah, band called Not Slip. Not Slip. Yeah. Searching, they are really, really good. And I mean, they are perfect, aren't they? Yeah, very, very good replicas. Look, sound, everything. They're brilliant. So that's at Ruby Lounge. So I'm gonna have a good night that night. Yeah. yeah. I love yeah. Slipknot. <laughs> and plenty more to come in between there, I imagine, as well, hopefully. Yeah. yeah. Well, thank you so, so much for having a chat to us today. It has been an absolute pleasure. I'm sure that we'll see you at one of these gigs, actually, in the next yeah, few definitely. months. Yeah, we'll you know. <laughs> so, brilliant. Thank you so much, and we will hopefully see you very soon. Thank you. Thank you very much. Bye. Cheers to Carlos as well. Quickly. Cheers, Carlos. <laughs>